What uh, t-shirt are you wearing, Spencer? Oh, just this Chinese murder van t-shirt. Whoa. You guys hear about these Chinese murder vans? Why don't you stand up and parade it around, you fine ass? Let me look at you. Damn, oh, dude. Oh, man. Holy Fucking shit. Man. Why don't you move that bush out of the way so oh I can look at your tits? <laughs> sorry. <laughs> that was just really... <laughs> well, said you I guess a that's face the story. Face. We got our I'm title. Really sorry. That was awful. Why don't you I'm, move that bush out <laughs> no, of the way so we Jesus. can look at your tits? I'm just trying to... C- I'm just spitballing t-shirt <laughs> ideas at this point. <laughs> I'm, I'm like, really you're, sorry. You're just a everyone. walking T-shirt idea yeah. factory. What? Uh, what Can is that, that T-shirt? One? I wish a, someone could explain it. Spencer, you, you guys wanna... hear about these Chinese murder vans? Speaking of shirts, no. I'm going to take mine. Well, mine. now you don't have to. It's not that because hot. you can own the Chinese murder van T-shirt. I'm fat. No, it's kind of hot up here. It's hot when you're. How fat. do we get one of these Chinese murder van T-shirts? Oh, it, that's simple. I, and I want it to be organic. Yes. Do you want to be a, a, it to be made by um, T Public? I meant more the segue, but sure, the materials should be organic as well. Yes. What were you segueing oh. to? An ad. Meundies. Chinese murder, oh. murder van T-shirt. <laughs> what, do, what if the what if Blue Apron made it, Blue Aprons out of micromodal, uh, three times softer than cotton? Now wow. that could be big. What if the what if the aprons vibrated every forty seconds? What if the- Airbnb offered free meundies for guests? Did Ooh. Apron come with you to New York? Apron Cost- <laughs> promotion. That, geniuses. Did, didn't didn't Dino bring Apron along? Apron seems like somebody that would hang out with Dino. <laughs> <laughs> Who is with you and Dino when you guys are traipsing around New York? Apron, right? There are people that we run into. Okay. Uh, but there's no. Remember Peter Blood? Oh, Peter Blood. He showed up for a little God cameo. Bless. Okay, excellent. Dino's friend Tom met us out. I bought okay. Dino a tiny cactus at a Aww. at a ca- tiny cactus store. Come on. Uh, we he he talked to an old fella on the sidewalk uh, about something. I don't know what they yeah, were talking about. I think they were crazy ta- conversation. It sounds like a fucked up Jim Croce song. They were ta- they were talking about God or something or maybe I'm projecting that because the guy had a yarmulke on and he was like very he seemed like kind of uh, uh, philosophical. Okay, uh, but they might have been talking about fucking Blue Apron. I don't know. I'm sure they were. Were they like, hey, <laughs> Jesus, <laughs> give me the Blue Apron comedy. What? Give you Blue Apron comedy? Com- Thanks. Sorry. Sorry. Everybody. Give you Blue Apron. Sorry. The show. My favorite thing is in the uh, about Blue Blue Apron ads in particular in podcasting is because when, when you listen to uh, true crime podcasts a lot, there's there's very often a very like like it's it's as if they're doing a bit like it's like 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 t- talking about a horrible murder uh, something that happens and then there's like no seam going into like <laughs> having this food delivered to your house. It's kind of funny. That's the best. Uh, I love yeah. that. It's like when they're like, we're going to be here all night solving this case. Uh, we should probably get some blue apron. Uh, well, or worse. No, it's no, it's more like her mangled body had been eaten by her own cat before officers got the, to the scene and the, the odor was attracting the police. Uh, I love acorn squash yeah. uh, and I cook with my kids all the time. And when I do, uh, <laughs> that's so, I mean, it definitely, it, it, with shows like that, it seems like you really could sell products because like you're instilling just utter fear oh yeah like, like, it's like, the kind of thing that makes you not want to leave your yeah, house I mean, and when you're not leaving your house you know you gotta have groceries you know that's what television is television is telling you do not stop watching this television like like you know like you you know go go get a car but but drive it back here and keep watching tv right 